Hey y'all. Hey guys. It's Cammie again and just come to tell you all about my appointment. Um, so today I'm just leaving the office. I'm actually outside still. Um, just leaving the office and today is cycle day. Uh oh. Maybe 13? I think it's cycle day 13 right now. So today I went in to start monitoring my follicles and um, I already did my letrozole 7.5 days, three through five. And today I went in for my ultrasound and labs today. So I just got my blood taken and um, I had my ultrasound done. So with the ultrasound, I got them to explain a little bit more to me. And today, um, I believe they said I only had one follicle that was 12, size of a 12, and the other one was a 14. They liked them to be between 18 and 20. Um, so mine still need to mature some. They need more time. She said it can grow about two a day, possibly. So they'll send me or bring me back in another day to get another ultrasound done and more labs. Not sure what day. I hope it's on the day that I'm off and the procedure is on the day that I'm off because I have to go to work. So that's how that was looking. Also this morning I kind of did a, what is it, a, not clinical car, but clear blue. I did a clear blue advanced digital ovulation test. And that showed a complete negative, um, unfortunately. But I kind of almost figured because my cervical mucus is kind of like normal, creamy. It's not even like watery yet or anything. So it's kind of expected. So I'm going to go back in. They'll probably, I'm thinking they'll probably tell me to come back in another two days instead of one. Since it only grows approximately two days, I don't think they'll tell me to come back tomorrow. So I'm thinking it'll be the day after tomorrow. So I'll keep you guys updated with everything and and just wish me the best of luck. And I'll just tell you all what goes on from here. Right now I'm just still taking my normal medicines and taking my two tabs of metformin 500. Um, I've been taking, I've been actually using Geritol every other day, switching it up with my prenatals, prenatal gummies. And also, I've been taking my levothyroxine 75 every morning. And I think that's all. I, oh, and I've been taking my folic acid tablet. So that's all. I'll keep you guys updated. And I'll talk to y'all later. Heading to work now. Bye.